could you go without your phone before you start to feel really uncomfortable, huh? Half hour? 45 minutes? Two hours? Well, the good people at Chick-fil-A want to put that to the test. As part of their new promotion, Chick-fil-A has created what is known as the Cell Phone Coop Challenge. Now you might be thinking, Anthony, what is the Cell Phone Coop Challenge? Well, my friends, <laughs> just hear me out. So here's how it works. When a family goes to sit down at a table at Chick-fil-A, there is a box at the table which is known as a cell phone coop. Now what all the family members have to do is turn their phones on silent and place them all inside of this cell phone coop without accessing them for the entirety of the meal. Now upon conclusion of the meal and if your head hasn't exploded from cell phone withdrawals, you let a Chick-fil-A employee know and you just got yourself a free ice cream. Now if you're used to my videos, you already know I got a million questions, right? Question number one, does Chick-fil-A have undercover operatives to ensure that each family is honoring the terms of the challenge? Number two, if not, can I have that job? Number three, okay, I get it, no cell phones. But nobody said anything about no Game Boy Colors or no Sega Game Gears, did you? Loophole. And really, how strict are they regulating this, right? But you know what, next time you go to a Chick-fil-A, look for a guy sitting at a table holding two cell phones triumphantly in the air, all while there's a portable flat screen playing right in front of his face, which is connected to a small generator while PlayStation 4 is all hooked up to that while he's eating his free ice cream. And guess what? That guy's gonna be me. But Chick-fil-A, bravo, this is a great idea. I love it. Way to help promote family unity and togetherness. What a nice concept. Almost nice enough to make us forget about that whole anti-gay marriage thing. <laughs> Almost. Damn, Anthony, why you gotta go bring up old stuff like that? Okay, okay, moving on, moving on. Now, this promotion has gone over pretty well. I mean, who could really hate on family and ice cream, right? But to me personally, it makes me kind of sad. I mean, how much of a bunch of fiends have we become that we won't put our cell phones down unless we are bribed with the concept of free food? My biggest fear is that once free food stops becoming a viable incentive, like, the human race is done, like we're just lost, like there's no hope, it's just gonna become the matrix, like that's it. Anyway, I'm pretty interested to seeing how this whole marketing scheme is gonna play out and how the challenge actually operates in the stores, but if you're good like me, you're gonna be able to get yourself a free ice cream while holding your cell phone in the other hand. Not because I did anything special, I actually paid for one ice cream and got another one by accident and they couldn't take it back to the kitchen, so <laughs> I got two, but hey, we're just talking semantics here, right? I mean. Whatever. Oh damn, that's pretty good. I'll see you next week.